All right, can we switch to the desktop, sir? Yeah, so we're just going ahead for our little topic today. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. How did this happen? Okay, well, let's we'll just try this real quick. Rip. Who Le broke boop. it? Cyber Shark, did you break it? Cyber broke it. Cyber broke it. God damn it. And activate. Yay! There we go. All right. So, um, we could sit here and talk about the 3000 series launch, but I thought it'd be more interesting to look at the used market because I want to see how much money you could save now by buying something like a 28 Ti, which right now the listings are like $700, but the real thing you want to look at if you want to know like average sale price or something is go down to the sold listings, which is like all the way at the bottom, sold items. And then you can kind of see where they're going for. Someone got a 28 Ti amp for $689, $800 uh, for a ROG Strix, $790 for a reference, $750. Somebody got scammed, $950. Another person oh got scammed. God. Uh $790, $600 for one of the custom water cooling block. Is this lightly used? That's a 1080 Ti. I was going to say, like, $445 is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. $849, $725. first one was a really good deal. Yeah, they got a really that? good deal on 689? that. 689 It was uh, or best offer, so um, that's pretty Well, usually good. it'll show a slash through it and say yeah. best offer accepted. Yeah, so. that's not bad at all, man. Like, I mean, just it's kind of crazy. These are all sold listings, 850 Some of these are stupid. Wow, okay. These might have been sold. I mean, it could have been earlier in the day yesterday, and that's why they sold for $1,000. That 675 that is really good nice comes with the evga power link and a 10-year warranty still through evga that's ridiculous 10-year warranty is a thing yes i think some evga cards have it um 28 ti oh could we get them but yeah no i mean these are all really affordable and then we got this one right here the 2070 super What's i mean sling bus? so for uh 400 bucks i mean cannot complain about that but i mean just up to you guys if it's worth waiting for you waiting for the new stuff to come out, see what AMD has to offer. Um, my thoughts are AMD's probably not going to compete with a 3090 or 3080. They're probably no. going to come in with something that's probably... Cause all their, yeah, probably like 3070 level card will probably be their top-of-the-line card. Um, so, I don't know, man. You could wait for 3070. It's probably going to be really hard to get those cards, by the way. So you better, if you're going to buy one, you'd be waiting at your computer. You should just click and buy and get whatever one you can get. Do we know they're actually going to be like release to buy yeah what are the dates chat i think those dates are out september so 3080 is september 17th mm. i don't know what the date is for is the 2070 in the same not 27 3070 i used to saying that 3070 is that in the same range now same date i don't know if it is 3070 would be i don't see date on that 29th for the 3090 3070 is oh it's not until october really oh huh that's weird then, because I mean, at that point, they, I know the main reason the 28 Ti's are getting so cheap is because of the 3070, because the 3070 is going to be that level of a car, but at $500. So that's yeah. probably why the price of the 28 Ti. I'm surprised dropped. people are already selling them off then. <laughs> I, I don't know. That is weird. Everything is coming out this month, though. September and October is 3090. 3070 is 20. Oh, which one is it, chat? <laughs> 3070 is October. 3070 is 24th. We're getting conflicting information here. Is this a good deal? Offer up. If it's on uh, offer up, maybe. Let's look. What do you got? Well, that's. Oh, you guys see another 30, yeah. a 2870 Super for 400. I like that. Is that a good deal? What's this Super? Uh, 2600 with a 1050 for. Is he really selling it for 120 bucks? Is it the whole PC? If he sells the whole PC for 120 dollars, then yes. But that seems really too good to be true. Does he use normal wear? It's not a great computer, but for $120, you could just buy the processor. So, I mean, I mean, it's a B450M. Like, the 1050 is kind of eh, but, like, I mean, everything. It has a one terabyte hard drive and a 120 gig SSD. Better, someone better snatch that. Yeah, that's that's kind of a really good deal if it actually is that price. That seems kind of weird, though. Um, but, yeah, man, I mean, the used market is just going to be flooded with these. I didn't see any deals on, like, 2060s, which I don't expect to until, like, the lower-end cards start coming out. Cause like you're still four hundred dollars. Don't buy that. You literally just saw like a twenty seventy super for the same price. Yeah. Like it's not worth buying these right now. Um, they're great cards. Don't get me wrong. But until they like drop down to like two hundred, two fifty, jeez. Just think about what ten seventies and stuff are gonna start going for. Those cards are still pretty decent used offerings. Like just imagine how far those are gonna drop. It'd be nice to see the freaking ten seventies at rx 580 price. Oh yeah, 1070s around hundred to one hundred forty dollars. They've been needing Ooh. to be that for a while. Ooh, that'd be so nice. Yeah, no, these, like, we're excited about the new launch, but, like, you can get such good pricing See on if these the 1070s have came down at all. 
yeah, let's see. I feel like a lot, like we're looking at a lot of this very early yes, on. It is very early, so I would say probably not. They're actually around two hundred dollars still. Uh, I don't know. Don't look like it. I hope you're not paying two hundred dollars for that right now. But I mean, yeah, everything it's like really early on. It's literally day after, so like things change. So I would expect probably end of September once stuff starting is already out on the market, then they'll probably go down in price. 